has been sort of the driving factor for you guys kind of being as uh, a stand as you think? Um, I think we're so successful because of Coach Lake. Um, he, does a, he does a good job of coaching all of us. Um, he knows the corner position, the nickel position, and the safety position uh, very well, and he makes sure that we're all honed in. Yeah. And as far as kind of the handing down of the mantle to a certain extent, where you go from somebody like Buddha and then you, know, you take over and Taylor's there, and then the next wave of guys, what's going to get on into that process of people stepping up as, as others move on? To NFL? Yeah, we like to say uh, taking the flag. Um, so you guys will always leave every year, but um, the next guy is always ready. And, you know, we got some fresh, freshmen right now. They could play today if they wanted. Um, so, yeah, we always got guys. Coach Lake does a good job of recruiting um, good guys that are ready to play. And so I think we do a really good job of just filling in. And of the young guys, who really kind of stands out to you at this point? Right? Yeah. Uh, well, Dom Hampton, shoot, I, I think you guys might see him um, at the game. Um, he does a really good job. Um, really, all the young guys from all the position groups, everybody impresses us. Uh, everybody that comes into this, onto this team, has a skill set, and those guys do a good job. And uh, what was your vantage point of Byron's pick six at the Pac-12 championship game? I was, what was I? I was on the other side of the field, like way behind him, and I seen him. Uh, yeah, I seen the ball go up and him take it, and I was just running, uh, like on the other side of the field, like trying to catch up. And so yeah. Yeah, I've seen a replay of that. Have you seen a replay of that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that one of the weirder interceptions you've ever seen? Yeah, it's just. I mean, he is kind of weird, but that's uh, that's ball skills because he, he was paying attention. Um, and, yeah, that, that won us the game. Yeah, thank you. JoJo, give me your thoughts on the Ohio State offense. Very good offense. Uh, they got a lot of weapons. Quarterback is good. Receiving core, they got some good linemen. So, yeah, it's going to be a challenge. What makes Dwayne Haskins as aggressive as he's been? Uh, he's just an elite quarterback. Um, he knows how to throw the ball. And, he has good reads. Mm -hmm. yeah. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing? Thank you. I learned that from Ken Griffey Jr. He always said, ask about how you're doing. Oh, yeah. Questions. Um, uh, why should people watch the Rose Bowl on Tuesday? Why do the people no, watch? Why, why, should the, why should people watch the Rose Bowl on Tuesday? Sure, like they say, it's the granddaddy of them all. Uh, it's the biggest game of the year. Uh, besides well, the national okay, championship, yeah. yeah. <laughs> a couple big games yesterday. Oh, yeah, yeah. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a good game. It's going to be a big one. Um, two great teams playing and going at it. So, yeah. What, it, what it will make this a good game? We got two good teams. Uh, good offense on both sides, good defense on both sides. And, you know, we're going to battle Pac-12 versus Big Ten. What does Washington mean to do to win on Tuesday? Uh, come out and play our A game. Um, come out all, like we did all season and just fight. I mean, yeah, I mean, I mean, the biggest game I remember, you know, the Texas-USC game, that's one of the biggest. But, yeah, growing up watching this game every year and being from out here, I always wanted to play in this game. It, it means a lot to be here finally, and, you know, it's a blessing. Um, and everybody here, even if they're not from the West Coast, you know, this is a big game, this is a big deal, and everybody loves it. Have you been to a Rose Bowl? I haven't been to a Rose Bowl game. I've been here plenty of times uh, when I was being recruited by UCLA. Back then when you were... uh, yeah, when we played, or when UCLA was recruiting me and I came here, it was a little more quiet. I heard it was very different. Uh, I heard the Rose Bowl, it fills up, um, and, it's, and it's crazy. So I'm excited. And what would it mean to kind of, you know, as a senior to go out and beat Ohio State and like, team yeah. and finally get that year six win in the Rose Bowl? Yeah, that would mean a lot. Uh, that would be a very big win for our team. Um, and we know that's, that we're playing a good opponent, so it'll mean much more. Yeah, thank you. How you doing? Good, how are you doing? Good. I'm waiting till my guy plugs into your microphone. <laughs> oh no, you're good. You having a good day so far? I am. Yeah. You? Yeah. yeah. Didn't get nearly as much sleep as I hoped for. Why not? Right now. We flew in late last night. Oh, okay. The plane was delayed, so. Coming from where? Seattle. Oh, okay. We're, we're with you guys. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's your guys' this morning entailed so far? Uh, we had some meetings today. Um, some, some lunch or some breakfast. And just came here. Yeah. yeah. Do you guys have to go back out to the Step Hub Center for actual practice today? Yeah, we do have practice today. Some more meetings. 
get right. Yeah. Yeah. Is it much different going through kind of the whole process in a different place than you know your normal where you go um, during the season or back home? I mean, the coaches do a good job of like our schedule doesn't really change too much, so we just like have a an order of everything we do. Um, so yeah, it's good. What do you think it means to the seniors on this team that your last game of your college career mm -hmm. will be the Rose Bowl? It's big. Um, I know a lot of guys on our team are from Southern California. This is something they grew up watching. Um, so it's a very big game, and we're playing a good team, so it means that much more. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be fun. What about for the program as a whole? I mean, the fact that you guys have been here 18 years since yeah. school. It's big time. Uh, I know they've, Washington have, has been trying to come back for 18 years. Um, it's a big game, and, you know, like I said, we're excited. On Tuesday, how are you guys going to stop Dwayne Hopkins? Uh, I mean, we just got to come out and play. Uh, he's a great quarterback. Uh, he has some good weapons. All around us, it's a good team. And so we're going to have to play, um, just come out and be physical. I'm sure you've watched plenty of tape on him. What's yeah. impressed you most about his game? Um, yeah, he has a good arm. Uh, he's, he can throw the ball. Uh, he can sling it. So, yeah, looking forward to playing him. Yeah. What about the team's uh, wide receivers? Do you think they're underrated at all this year? No, they got some good wide receivers. Um, all four guys, starting four guys, very good, talented, catch the ball, got some good speed, so it'll be a challenge. How hard is it preparing for a team when they do have different types of weapons and not just like one guy that's the guy? Um, I, mean, I mean, I feel like the Pac-12, we play a lot of teams with weapons everywhere. Um, and I think we do a good job defending it. Um, and so, yeah, it'll, it'll be a good challenge. This whole experience as a whole, what's been the best part so far? Uh, I guess just spending my last week with my guys, uh, my last game, just enjoying everybody's company and whatnot, so yeah. Have you thought about and had a chance to reflect yet on what it's going to be like to play your last college football game? <laughs> I, I've been avoiding it, um, but I mean, sometimes when I'm in the room, I'll think about it, but yeah, I just, I'm just trying to enjoy it right now. Yeah. What have you thought about all kind of the hoopla and the different events you've gotten to do from Disneyland, eating all the prime mm -hmm. rib? All that fun stuff. It's fun. Uh, it's just cool just hanging out, having some time um, to just chill. Um, but no, I think everybody's just excited to play in the game. I think that's going to be the most fun we have this week. Obviously, yeah. you guys probably try and block out the noise, just focus on you guys. Mm. But as a college football player, going up against a college football coach like Urban Meyer, who's going to go down in the record books, yeah. I mean, is, what's it like knowing that you're going to play in his final last game? I mean, I mean, I guess it's cool. Uh, yeah, I'm, I don't really know what to say to that. Yeah. Do you have any thoughts on him as a coach or his coaching style? Uh, I don't really know him. I just know he's a great coach. He's been doing a lot of great things. Um, but no, I don't really know him personally. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy all this. Thank you. Oh uh, yeah. I'm good. How you doing? Don't worry. Yeah. I asked you the tough questions. <laughs> <laughs> Got to see your family a lot? Yeah. Every I've been night? Not every night. I've just been seeing, like, friends every night, family sometimes. So, yeah. It's cool. Yeah. 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 Yeah.